So hello everybody, this is Zaxter99. Today I'm going to be talking about Rocky, our bearded dragon again. And I did a search on YouTube and I could not find the answer to a particular question that I was asked uh, recently. And that is, how do you know if your bearded dragon, once you get one, how do you know if it's happy? How do you know? Because they can't make any sound. They can't purr like a cat. They can't even really tell you when they're sick except showing you a black beard and, you know, the way they behave. So how, you know, I've had, we've had Rocky almost a year now. And how do you know if your bearded dragon is happy? Well, to answer that question, I think it's as simple as taking a look at his behavior in the cage. And if your bearded dragon, while being in the same room with him, which I notice my bearded dragon likes it when I'm in the same room and I'm watching TV or we have family in our room, you'll see him watch you through the cage you'll see him get up and dance now right now he's being kinda lazy and all bearded dragons I believe are gonna be like this they're gonna be lazy at some points or for most of the day uh, and they're just gonna lounge around they're gonna you know get up under their their heat lamp on the uh, log there wherever you have your your heat lamp set up there but pretty much every day as long as you're interacting with him and talking to him and he can hear family in the same room I think your bearded dragon is going to show you that he likes that. Our bearded dragon will get up and kind of walk around. Even at almost a year old, he's, he's fully grown. He will get up and, and look through the glass and, and he will kind of dance, uh, you know, and kind of shuffle about. And he will do that quite a bit, uh, you know, and that, that's one way you can tell he's happy. Another way you can tell if he's happy is simply by looking at his eyes. Just like a human, I think you can tell a lot by looking at their eyes. And you can tell, you know, how alert they look, if they look like they're healthy, and if they look like they're happy. Unfortunately, they're not going to smile for you. They're not going to laugh or anything like that. But another way you can tell is, you know, how much do they love you? How, how much do they trust you? Well. You want to get your bearded dragon to where every day, anytime you want, you can kind of get him to where he will, you know, when you put your, you want to be able to put your fingers right under his chest like this, right, and get him to where he'll put his hands on you, and if you go to lift him up under his belly, he'll crawl up on you, like you'll see Rocky do here. If they do that, that means they trust you, okay? Once they trust you to where you're not going to hurt him, then making them happy is pretty simple. And you can see how happy they are. Really easy, I believe, by simply laying him on your chest, kind of leaning back, and kind of stroking, running a finger along his back, backbone there, and watching him. And if he really trusts you, he'll start going to sleep. They're right, Rocky. Just talk to him and just love him like you would your dog or any other pet that you have. Now one thing our bearded dragon really likes, I believe he likes to be stroked along his, his backside like this. But another thing our bearded dragon really likes is right here. This is where he hears, I believe, this hole here. But if you take your finger and you really gently, really light your your finger run along where his mouth ends there and run it right right along the end of his mouth crack there they're gonna keep their mouth closed unless they're eating but if you take your finger and you kinda run it right along that crack there uh, Rocky seems to love that and I'm guessing that other bearded dragons would be the same so certainly try that just do it really soft really tender and really lovingly Run your finger along the his closed mouth and run it right along close to his uh, his hole there in his head where he hears, I believe. And Rocky really seems to like that. And then you can kind of lightly stroke his head like that. Just continue to pet him. 
it'll eventually go to sleep. And I think that's one real good sign that you have a happy bearded dragon. And that's one way they trust you. And they do need this interaction, you know, at least probably every other day, if not every day. It's good to take them out and let them, let them sit on your chest or sit on your shoulder. Um, and kind of pet them for at least a half hour or something. You know, you can do this while you're watching TV or, or just kind of lounging, talking to your family or whatever. But they like this interaction and it's good for them. It's going to help them. If you don't do this, they can turn aggressive and be really aggressive and you try to stick your hand in there to feed them or, or anything else. They can, uh, they can get aggressive and, and you don't want that. But anyway, I think that's how you know your bearded dragon is happy. Do you want to go ahead and say thank you for watching? This has been Rocky another YouTube video and again look at his eyes there you can see his eyes look at his eyes look how alert he looks you can tell that he's healthy and happy there that right Rocky yeah yeah you're a good beardy huh yeah <laughs> and I'm kind of holding him up like right now see he trust me yeah you trust me huh yeah all right, this has been Zaxter99. Thanks so much. Uh, be sure you go ahead and subscribe, share, and like this video if it's helped you out. Be sure you leave any comments below. Uh, be sure you also uh, rate this video up, thumbs up, or thumbs down. You can do that by moving your cursor to the upper right corner of this video and give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. Does it help me? Uh, let me know if you like the content that I'm getting it, uh, out to you guys. And uh, be sure you go ahead and uh, subscribe if, as well if you're not already subscribed. And be sure you leave those comments below. Let me know if you have a bearded dragon, how you like to make him happy, how you know if he or she is happy, and how many bearded dragons you have. And you know, be sure you ask any questions as well. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. This has been Zaxter99. Have a good one.